Alright guys, the mayor here, back with another Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle video. And today I'm gonna be talking about what we could possibly see for part two of JP's Kao Ken Blue Goku celebration. Um before I get started, I just wanna say if you're new, uh, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe because when I did my one year video it said that most of my people that watch my videos aren't subscribed. So if you wanna watch my videos and get notified whenever they come out, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Let's get started. So, so Global got Kao Ken Blue Goku first in their Full of Wonders Merry Christmas campaign. So, part one um, had Kao Ken Blue Goku. The banner changed for JP, uh, future Gohan came back, which is okay. Um, so, during this, actually, uh, Prime Battle Krillin will be coming out and an easy A for the Spirit Sword Trunks. So in part one, all we got was the Kyle Campbell Goku and Universal Survival Saga Category Summon, and the rest of the stuff won't be coming to JP, well, some of it won't be because it was just Christmas stuff. So when we go to look at part two, we had a legendary summon banner. Um, Kill and Khalifa had not been on Global for a while. I. I'd rather them act, I'd, I had re, would have rathered if they came out regularly and not uh, Dokkan have waited to release them with this celebration, but that's okay. But they released a legendary summon banner for Kale and Cauliflaw. And um, they had EZA. And they had the Tanabata banner, but JP's not getting the Tanabata banner till like later i don't think they're getting the tanabata banner anytime soon um so all they had was a legendary summon banner nothing too crazy so give me a second so i can pull up the jp version of the celebration uh campaign dokkan campaign um here we have Ella, we have kion khalifa the tr art um this to me, like in the thumbnail you saw, in Kefla. I think that a Kefla could be coming, but let's just go through celebration. Uh, missions, uh, the Just Festival, uh, the banner, like I said, Future Go On came back, Universal Survival category, Summon came back here. Um, something I want to point out Kale, I meant uh, Kefla, is on the banner. Not like, I, I, she would be on the banner either way. She's on the cover for the banner. That's another thing that I think. Um, Kao Ken Blue Goku, the story events are coming back. Then all the stuff for April Fools comes tomorrow, not today. I don't know. Uh, Spirit Sword Trunks, easy A. LR Prime Battle Krillin, thank you for finally adding a Krillin to the game. It's gonna be great. Eight more days till he comes out. Can't wait for him. Um... And that's really it. So now, I will be talking about who I think could be coming for the celebration. Now, I think, just like you saw, Kef Kale and Cauliflaw were like the characters that they showed to show the campaign. I think that, like, that shows to me that they're probably going to make an Ella or Kefla. But there are a few other options they could do, which I think I would be fine with. They could do an Android 17 and 18, but I don't think that's happening because I already have two LR 17 and 18s. I mean, one's with 16, but it's mainly 17 and 18. I doubt they're going to do another one like this soon. I think they're going to wait for that. Next, uh, maybe they could release a dual Gohan and Piccolo card. That would be really, really cool to see. I would want to see that. That's a really cool card. Um... And then we have Jiren, so I don't have it pulled up because I couldn't find pictures, but it, one of his assets were changed, not on this card art, another one for the raid battle. His assets were changed, uh, they made his shirt red, it wasn't red before, and they put the tear in his pants, which wasn't there before. Like I said, not this one, the one from the raid battle. So they changed that, so that means like one of two things for me, either... 
they are going to be making an LR Jiren, which I doubt because LR Jiren and LR Goku, I think that seems like a dual Dokkan Fest or a dual Dokkan Fest LR. That does not seem like it would just be a regular legendary summon LR. I mean, eventually it'll happen, but not yet. It's going to be a dual Dokkan Fest LR. Um, or they are going to bring back the Jiren raid. But I also think that Kefla is like a very, very good option. But I have one more character that, one more person that I think could actually be coming as an LR. As you see here, we do not really have that many representatives for the Turtle Hermit Master Roshi. So his voice actor died last week or two weeks ago. Over the course of the past two weeks, his his voice actor died. I think um, that they, since they're doing Tournament of Power and it's a Goku banner, I think they could release the, the Roshi with his Kamehameha, which is a really, really cool scene. I think that would make a really, really cool card. They would do it like somewhat like in memory of him. I don't know. I like This is just what I'm thinking. I just think that that would be a really cool card that a lot of people would summon for and a lot of people would like. Um, well that's really what I'm thinking. Uh, put in the comments what you think could be coming. This is the mayor and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.